my name is Takia and if you guys are just viewing this video welcome to my channel so I recently was admitted into nursing school and I pretty much found myself debating between which two schools I would like to join sorry I don't need teaching but <laughs> so I um, got accepted into Central Georgia Technical College and also Mercer University and I'll tell you the pros and the cons of both schools and pretty much why I decided to go where I went and well, where I'm going and stuff of that nature. So at first, I came home from college and I took prerequisites to get into Central Georgia Technical College. I was like, okay, I'll just take these four classes, pretty much go in straight like that. But my first time, I was denied, denied. And I was bumped. So I'm like, dang, like, what did I do to, like, get denied? Like, I really, I really thought I did good. But come to find out, I had a C at UGA. And they got that C and used that towards my, pretty much my GPA for the nursing program. And it, it didn't cut. I was, like, the third or something before the cutoff. But, what well, after the cutoff. But, yeah. Um, so, yeah, I pretty much soul searched for a year I was working continue to work continue to finish like classes in case I was accepted later on down the road so I kept taking classes and then in around Mayish of this year I found out about the accelerated BSN program at Mercer so I applied there I took classes at this um, community college called Rio Salado because they needed you to take nutrition and pathophysiology so I took both of those and pretty much made an A <laughs> in both of those. So I was accepted into the program. Um, but yeah, so when I was accepted, I was like, okay, well, I'll just wait to see if I get accepted into Central Georgia Tech as well. So I got accepted into Central Georgia Tech as well. Hooray me, because I retook that psychology, that psychology course and made an A. So it replaced that one. So we're good to go. <laughs> so yeah. Um, I made so my GPA I want to say for Central Georgia Tech was like a 3.8 for the prereqs and my GPA for Mercer was about I want to say a 3.4.5 ish pretty much so yeah I did both of that and of course both of them made you take the T's exam if you don't know what the T's, T's exam is you may want to look into it especially if you're looking into becoming a nurse because most schools take that they also require the HESI sometimes I know Augusta State University has a master's program that requires the GRE so it really just depends on where you go so make sure you research that um, the T's was pretty simple for me I, it's basically like four parts you have reading have math you have science and then English science weighs the heaviest out of everything so it's really best to like study the science part. I'll probably do a video later about what I studied for the T's and how I pretty much mastered <laughs> and made an 80. So, which is, you know, pretty good to get into school. So it's pretty, yeah, 80 out of 100, I would say that's pretty good. So yeah, the pros though, let's get into the pros and the cons of each program. So the pros of the program for Central Georgia Tech is short, pretty short. Um, you only have to take, I want to say, six semesters. It's short, but I guess the pros of Mercer it will be shorter there too, because it's only a one-year program. So okay, so it's short. But the main pro of Central Georgia Tech's program is that it is cheap, 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 cheap. Technical schools are really, really cheap. So it really helps if you're not trying to get into more debt or something of that. Something if, if you just if you are looking for a cheaper option, Central Georgia State is the way to go. However, since it is cheaper, the competition they have something called a competitive health selection. The competition to get into the program is really, really high. Hence the fact that I have a I had to have a 3.8 and also an ADT score, which is not average, I wouldn't say. It's kind of kind of great, so <laughs> yeah. Um, and another pro about it is that it's, it's local for me. I, I live in Macon, so I pretty much wanted somewhere close for me in Macon. 
so the cons that I would say for this program is that it's short but some BSN programs are the same length if you already have like a college degree like I do so when you're taking these classes you only get awarded an ASN I guess but I mean it, the upside to that though you can always do RN to BSN or RN to MSN depending on what you're looking for inside of your career so the next school of course Mercer let's talk about them the pros of that program is one year one year accelerated BSN program come on one year that's super quick and you get a whole bachelor's of nursing and I know you guys are like why you didn't take that what's wrong why you didn't take that so the cost of that program is sixty thousand dollars sixty thousand dollars and you're probably like that's a lot of money and I agree that is a lot of money so eventually I'm going to start posting things about my experience throughout nursing school the struggles that I had I also post another video about my study habits and study st and strategies that I use for my T score and stuff of that nature so be on the lookout for that so once again Central Georgia Tech versus Mercer University and I chose Central Georgia Tech of course